Hello everybody, and welcome to today's video on something. Um, to be completely honest with you guys, today I was supposed to put up, um, I know I didn't tell you guys this, but in my head, since then I figured it out. I'm like, oh, okay, well since the first four chapters of Dracula are Jonathan Harker's um, journal, I'll just do, what the hell is going on here? I'll just do um, my first video on the fourth. And that still is kind of the plan. <clears throat> but something finally came in the mother effing mail today. And um, I was just too excited. And I have to share it with you guys. So um, this is also like subtitled, um, or AKA, um, the importance of proof copies of your work. Okay. Like when you're getting paperbacks and stuff like that, right? <clears throat> so here we go. Okay, <clears throat> so fingering the mundane. The book is here. <laughs> All right, so that's really cool. Um, it looks good. It's nice and sturdy, but here is the bitch. Now, if you see that, the spine um, has this like white bit coming on right here. And it's because of this picture. <clears throat> now, um, the thing that is strange about this is that we followed the templates, um, the cover templates exactly. Because when you, when you do it, it's basically a picture like that, like one big rectangle. Okay. And, um, when we did it, they said, <clears throat> um, that there was too much on the, um, outside edges that was in danger of getting cut. And if you look, there really isn't like, this is like, that's like what, like a quarter of an inch. I don't know. So anyway, so we ended up like um, squeezing it down. And then because we thought this was going to be an issue, once we squeezed it down, we actually made this bigger. And um, I don't know, maybe it's something as silly as when you're layering in Photoshop, this picture was above um, the text box for that, or the layer for the spine. So anyway, um, this is just one of those little things, and it's really not even that big of a deal, but I'm kind of pissed off about it. So um, I think I'm going to... Um, just fix it and like probably I should get another proof copy but honestly if I move this picture an eighth of an inch this way um, that should more than take care of that so I'm not worried about that but the book looks really good I don't like this I'm gonna go back and get rid of this um, where it says like the name of the book I just don't like it um, there was a part of me that thought the print was too big, but then I checked it against a bunch of other books, and it's a bit correct. Like, it's kind of what I have a lot of books of. So, um, I think it's, uh, 13 font size. Um, so yeah, so... 
in looking through here, I already found something that um, I fucked up. So, and it's so funny because you get these, or you, you put these things together and you read it over and over and over and over again. You let other people read it. And um, shit just, like, I don't know if it's that thing where your brain finishes words for you. Um, it's funny because I think it's only one time, but it's enough to piss me off. So um, I'm going to show it to you real quick if I could find it. Okay, here we go. Maybe there's two. Well, I can only find this one. Okay, so anyway, so here we go. If you look at the name right here, Tony, it's T-O-N capital I. And I think what I did there was I did a, um, like a dwit, um, dwit thing where I did a find and replace on a poem where I'm like, okay, if there's any, uh, lowercase eyes, um, with a space after it because I'm like, huh, wait a second. Cause if it just starts capitalizing every eye in the place, that's, that's going to be a bad thing. So I did a space, I did a little eye space and to change it to big eye space, but I should have done space, little eye space, space, big eye space. Um, and so I think I fucked myself by doing that because like how many words end with I apparently the name Tony. So, um, that was a, a fuck up. Um, so I found that, so I'm going to fix that. And, um, other than that, like the book looks good. The thing that is also strange is pictures and books. So like, you never know, like when you're making, um, the shit, you never know how big the picture is going to be, or at least I don't like, um, I've tried to make them bigger. I've tried to make them smaller. I mean, it's not bad. Like I don't, I don't, hate it it's just it's just strange because in the stuff I sent in everything looked a lot bigger than that and apparently it's not so um pictures and jpegs those are very tricky I don't know if you if you know a good way to get around it uh, maybe it's as simple as just making sure it is like eight by ten or not eight by ten what is this six by nine so what five by eight I don't know something like that um, yeah it's just it's um, it's kind of weird but everything else turned out really cool like I'm I'm digging the book I, the page numbers are correct that's always a fucking a punch in the dick, you know? Like, the table of contents looks awesome. I fucking love it. So, yeah. So, um, first edition came out tits. So, I'm pretty stoked. But, yeah, I just, this is bothering me. So, um, I'll fix that, and I'll fix that big eye, and, um, yeah. So make sure, and I was, I was going to try to find it, but I have a proof copy of the first, um, what do you call it? Um, the first self-published book I ever did. And, um, ew, what a fucking train wreck that was. I was going to, I couldn't find it, but it's like, it's a poetry book from like 2006, I think. And you open it up, and all the poems are going this way. Like, the lines are vertical. Um, 
and you're like, and for a second, I remember thinking, I'm like, can I pull this off? Like, this is like some kind of like cool artsy thing. And I'm like, no, this looks shit. It looks awful. Don't do this. So that was that. Um, and I have other stuff to show you, but um, we'll cut this one short at 10 minutes just so I could um, get back to the Dracula stuff. And um, hopefully I'll have that video up tonight. Okay. So, um, oh, and if anyone's interested, um, once I get those books final, they are going to go to the people who supported the campaign on Indiegogo first. And once everyone got their book and everything's cool, then um, I will put those up for sale. But um, not until those people get theirs first. That is the rule. So anyway, until um, I do this damn Dracula video, I will talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.